Hi everyone, this is Miss Conti, and today I'm going to be reading to you Somebody and the Three Blairs. This book is by Marilyn Tolhurst, and the illustrations are by Simone Abel. One Sunday morning, in a small house on the edge of town, Mr. Blair, Mrs. Blair, and Baby Blair were sitting down to breakfast. It's such a fine morning, said Mr. Blair. Let's take a walk in the park. What a good idea, said Mrs. Blair. Feed a ducks, said Baby Blair. So they took their coats and a bag of breadcrumbs and set out for the park. While they were gone, somebody came to the door. Somebody knocked, and when no one answered, somebody tiptoed. He sniffed and sniffed. He looked at the breakfast table. This food is too dry, said somebody. This food is too noisy, said somebody. But this food is just right. He looked for somewhere to sit down. This seat is too hard, said somebody. This seat is too wobbly, said somebody. But this seat is just right. He looked for something to play with. This game is too noisy, said somebody. This game is too cold, said somebody. But this game is just right. He looked for something to drink. This rain is too hot, said somebody. This pond is too small, said somebody. But this stream is just right. He looked for somewhere to sleep. This bed is too big, said somebody. This bed is too small, said somebody. But this bed is just right. When Mr. and Mrs. Blair and Baby Blair came back from the park, they saw the breakfast table. Somebody has been eating my crunchies, said Mr. Blair. Somebody has been eating my crispies, said Mrs. Blair. All gone said Baby Blair. They looked around the room. Somebody's been sitting on my chair, said Mr. Blair. Somebody's been sitting on my chair, said Mrs. Blair. Busted, said Baby Blair. They went into the kitchen. Somebody has been emptying the cupboard, said Mr. Blair. Somebody has been reading the fridge, said Mrs. Blair. Naughty, said Baby Blair. They went upstairs. Flood, shouted Mr. Blair. Helped, shouted Mrs. Blair. Lots of water, shouted Baby Blair. They looked in the bedrooms. It's a burglar, said Mr. Blair. It's a monster, said Mrs. Blair. It's a big teddy bear, said Baby Blair. It's escaped from the zoo, said Mr. Blair. It's escaped from the circus, said Mrs. Blair. It's escaped down a drain pipe, said Baby Blair. Somebody phone the police, said Mr. Blair. Somebody call the fire department, said Mrs. Blair. Somebody gone home, said Baby Blair. Bye-bye. Come again and play tomorrow. And that is the end of our story. Thank you very much for listening. I hope you have a wonderful day.